Welcome to Project Bearded. I'm Brian. We are wrapping up week 30 of my year. And in this video, I like to talk to you guys about soybean oil. But before I do, I would like to ask just a small favor, and that's for you guys to show me your support by giving this video a thumbs up when you smash that like button below. And if you aren't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Those two small gestures don't cost you anything, but they would mean the world to me as they will help this channel grow so we can reach more like-minded individuals and maybe even inspire some future beersmen. So once you've liked and subscribed, we'll be able to jump into today's bearded content. After last week's video, I decided to go check out my local big box stores. So I went to Walmart, CVS, and those type of places to see what it is they offer for beard care products. And in most cases, they had a selection of three to five different companies. So I looked through them to see what was up. And while I was going through the ingredients list, I noticed that most of them for their beard oils contain soybean oil, which is not an ingredient I'm accustomed to seeing in my beard care products. So I made a decision not to buy anything at that time and I went home to research soybean oil to see what benefits it could have for our beard health. Soybean oil does contain omega-6 fatty acids as well as high amounts of vitamin E and it has been shown to help retain moisture and even stimulate hair growth. However, when you look at the plethora of other carrier oils we have as options for ingredients, it's just kind of in eh at doing those things. And there are a lot of other better options out there. On top of that, it only has a one year shelf life. So soybean oil doesn't last as long as those other options, which do a better job. There is one thing going for soybean oil though and that is that it is very inexpensive to purchase. It is just downright cheap. And when I take everything into consideration, to me, it kind of feels like soybean oil is a filler ingredient that some companies may be using. Because of that, if given the choice to buy a beard care product such as beard oil with soybean oil or without, I would choose and recommend to pick a beard care product that does not contain soybean oil. Now don't get me wrong, soybean oil isn't bad for you. It certainly is not gonna harm your beard in any way. But like I said before, given the plethora of choices out there of better quality ingredients, I would recommend using a beard oil or any beard care product that does not contain soybean oil in it. With that being said, I headed back to CVS to check out some of the oils they had that did not contain soybean oil. And to give you guys just a little sneak peek of what you can expect for next week's video, I did pick up this bottle from Brisk Grooming and have started testing it. And I anticipate being able to review it on next week's video. So definitely stay tuned for that. And that concludes this video. But before I wrap it up, I would like to thank you guys for sticking around to the end. That tells me that you did indeed enjoy today's bearded content. So do me a favor and double check to make sure you did smash that like button below so you can give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel and turn on those notifications so you won't miss any of my videos. Then leave me a comment below, share this video with your friends, and while you're at it, why don't you head on over to Instagram and follow me there, at Project Bearded. A link will be in the description. Once again, I'm Brian, this is Project Bearded, and I will see you guys in the next video.